Hey guys, and welcome back to part three of Let's Get to Know Sunset Valley. This is a lovely shot of Zelda that we're looking at, and the moment that all of you have been waiting for, we need to know, is Zelda pregnant or is she not? And, um, drum roll please. Um, Zelda is not pregnant, so a bullet was definitely dodged on that one like seriously that would have been the most awkward thing to this family to happen but Zelda is not pregnant so I guess that's good depending some of you probably really wanted to see the drama but I think it's a good thing that um we at least don't have a new child being brought into the mix so with that being said there's still the issue with Dustin actually um, being in love with Zelda. He is in love. Um, and he's obviously not happy in his relationship with Ileana because their relationship is not that high. And they've just not had the spark lately. So, obviously, there is the issue with... You know, is Dustin going to stay with Ileana or is he going to leave and run off with Zelda May? And I guess we're just going to have to see how this episode plays out. This is going to be the last episode that we, or part, that we play with the Landrak family. So sadly, we are going to have to say goodbye to them. But that's okay, because we can get to know another family and delve into their drama. So, with that being said... Please leave a comment or tweet at me or whatever you feel like to tell me what family you would like to see next in this series. And yeah, I will see kind of what you guys think and who you want to see next and we'll go from there. Also, um, I asked if you guys would like to see a renovation to this house since it's a, like a base game playing Jane house right now and um, I got a tiny bit of feedback saying that you wanted me to renovate the house but you wanted me to keep the style of the house and not change it too too much so that's what I'm going to do and that's going to be at the end of this episode so if that's not your thing then you can of course watch until we get to the renovation Cobina and oh gosh singing in the shower that always annoys me so much but if that's not your thing then you can I guess feel free to go but I would really like for you to stay and that will be at the end but for right now we're gonna finish off with this Zelda Dustin Ileana triangle and kind of see what's gonna happen here comes Ileana oh shit I mean I mean shoot <laughs> she is going to actually accuse him of cheating how does she know? Oh gosh. Um. Um. Well, this is awkward. And the computer froze because it's just like too much drama for it to handle. It's like, whoa there. Okay, so. I guess. Ileana is kind of solving it for herself. I mean, look at that face. I think she's pretty darn angry. Um. That's so lovely. I'm going to keep that for the archives, my love. But I think she's pretty mad. Oh, gosh. She's livid. She's going to slap him. Whoa. 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 <laughs> oh, you get him, girl. He cheated with your sister. You need to slap him a little bit harder than that. Oh. All right. Well, you need to dump him. How about you just break up with him? Just wipe your hands, wash your hands clean of this, and say, you know what? You get out. But are you even mad at your sister? I mean, it's kind of your sister's fault, too, for being a slut. <laughs> all right. So this all went down in the bathroom downstairs. Um, poor kid. So he's just doing his homework like, oh, my God, my parents are cray-cray. And she is, too. Oh, this is awkward. Oh. Oh. Just too much. Okay, so. Oh, God. She's going to jump him in the bathroom. Oh, oh guys. 
Oh, guys, 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 what is this? What is this family? I don't even understand. What is happening? I could probably have gotten a better picture. <gasps> he kicked her butt. Oh my god, he kicked the mother of his children's butt. Oh my, I didn't even, this isn't, this is really unplanned, guys. Okay, so now Dustin's gonna walk away from the situation and talk about movies with his daughter while Ileana is a very, very pissed ex-wife. So what I'm thinking is um, he needs to get out of this situation. She's gonna come fight him again. Guys, this is... I'm just watching this unfold. Like, this is like a freaking soap opera. Yes, as the kiddos um, sit here and peacefully talk about school while their parents are fighting. Yes, this is so lovely. Let's put up the walls and have this be a very nice theatrical um, uh, shot here. Okay. Family get together. Oh my. Did this really just happen? Did it? Did this really just happen? Because I'm very... I can't even get her in the picture. <laughs> okay. Alright, so... He has now kicked the mother of his children's butt twice. I think that he needs to move out. I think it is time, guys, to say his goodbyes because literally this has just gotten more awkward by the minute so when zelda gets home i'm thinking that um dustin needs to get the heck out of here and move out with zelda i'm probably just gonna kick them out so they can find a random house oh no she can okay Ileana, you need to just go i suggest you go upstairs and you take a nice bath and get over it because this it's just gone too far, girl. You don't need to fight. Twice is enough. Getting your butt kicked. Getting your butt kicked twice is enough, I think. So, that is enough fighting for one day. Goodness gracious, that was crazy. So, poor children, you know? Like, they just had to witness that. That was, that was probably the most awkward thing any of my sim children have ever witnessed in their life. So, we're just gonna wait for Zelda to get home. Okay, so I just tweeted. <laughs> if you guys thought that we should just kick Ileana out, because honestly, let's be serious, no one really likes her anyways. She's an uptight, workaholic, crappy mother. So, I think it would probably be better if Dustin and Zelda just kind of stayed here with the kids, but... I don't know. I tweeted, but probably no one will tweet me back because I only have like 30 followers. But, you know, we'll see. We'll see. I don't know what I'm thinking. I really don't. This all just happened so fast. Um, but I honestly really like Dustin and Zelda and Ileana. Just, I mean, look at her thumbnail right here. She's a crank. She's betrayed. And she... You know, she started a fight in front of the kids. Like, I feel like she needs to just get out. Because if Dustin and Zelda have to leave, that's sad. Because the kids actually have a relationship with both of them. And like both of them better than they do Eliana. So, I feel like that would probably just be the best thing for everyone. I don't know. I'm, like, arguing with myself right now. It's kind of fudged up. But, um, I don't know where Zelda's at. She needs to come home because... We got some things to talk about. Here she is. Here she is home. Alright, so come up. Where are you going? Oh, he's going to read his daughter to sleep. That's okay. You can do that. You're going to read her to sleep in Parker's bed. What? Oh, no. Wait, what? What bed are you going to? I'm so confused. Zelda's bed. Okay. Okay. Whatever. We're going to take a picture of that. Because it's priceless. Priceless moment in the land in the life of a Landrac. Let's put the walls up. Oopsies. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm getting all theatrical here. Okay. So that's good. That's good. That's good. We're good. All right. 
that's enough because Parker always reads short stories and she's always okay with that. So we're going to go hit up Zelda. Um, maybe give her a dip kiss because they're finally free to do what they please. Um, yeah, we'll kiss her. And I'm thinking that we're going to kick Ileana out. But probably won't do that while she's already in bed. The woman's going to have a rough day. We'll probably do that tomorrow when she wakes up. Like, bye-bye. 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 Um, for now, just have a make-out session with Zelda. Sounds good to me. And... You should probably go to bed in your own bed. I don't understand what it is with your bed that you don't like. Your bed is fine. Totally fine. Go sleep here. Parker. It's getting late. Can you go to bed? Thank you, sir. And them too. Oh, they're probably going to go make some woohoo. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. While his ex-wife is upstairs, this is the most awkward situation I think I've ever in my life been in in The Sims 3. Like, I'm dead serious. This is so awkward. Okay. We are going to hold her hands, and then you will guess that we're going to pray for a baby. How about that, guys? How about that? And then maybe she'll be for real pregnant this time. This is so fudged up. Like, I know, this is seriously effed up, but, you know, I feel like I'm directing my own soap opera, and in soap operas, some pretty fudged up stuff happens, so you guys are just gonna have to go with it. Go with it. Someone commented and said it's like a, that in England, you call your soap operas, um, EastEnders? EastEnders? What? Okay. You know, you learn something new every day. This is why I like talking to you guys. You guys tell me all the cool stuff that I need to know. All right. Look at this. Hey. Hey. Finally free to be together. All right. What am I doing? Let's just zoom in real close. Let's get all up in their business. Oh, how cute. Depends on how you look at it. Cute or scandalous. I don't know. All right. You guys, do your thing. Every single night and every single day, I'm gonna do my thing. I should probably never sing again. You guys are probably cringing. Ears are bleeding and I'm so sorry. Oops. Oh, snap. <laughs> She's actually pregnant. <laughs> what have I done? Oh, please tell me what I've done. I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, guys. So for some strange reason, Ileana is actually awake already. And um, I think she just wants to get out of here as fast as she can. Of course, deep, 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 deep down in her little evil body, she cares about her kids. And she will see them sometimes. But honestly, this girl was never cut out for family life. She was never just cut out for this crap so i think her moving out on her own and just focusing on her job honestly i think that's what she wants so hate on it get over it if you're mad that i'm kicking her out that's a shame because i this is just this family's been great but um yeah so we're gonna kick her out honestly i think she just wants to get out it's not like she hates her kids once again she just it's not her thing. This has not been her day. And what's worse, Zelda is not just a random girl. Guys, remember, this is her sister. So, mm, awkward as heck, yes. Kind of incestuous, yes. Um, <laughs> so, Parker and Kaylin Landrak are going to stay here and live with their dad, Dustin Landrak. And their Aunt Zelda, whom their dad is going to have a baby with. What would that make the baby? The baby would be their half... That'd be their half-sibling, but it would also be their cousin. Would that make their dad also their uncle? Oh my god, this is so wrong. I'm gonna barf. But anyways, Ileana's gonna move out. Um, we're just gonna kick her out, and she's gonna do her own thing. Goodbye, Mama. It's been a wild Goodbye. ride. Um, it's been fun, Landjurax. <laughs> I think we're done messing with them. 
um, I, I would say that we've kind of made a big impact on their lives, <laughs> but hopefully everyone's happy. I think the kids, it's kind of incestuous. It's kind of awkward. It's kind of really messed up, but, um, oh gosh, you dog just ruined the couch. I hate you. Go here. But yes, it's kind of messed up. I, I will acknowledge that, but this is a game. This is the Sims. Sometimes some crazy stuff goes down and that's what makes it fun because we get to play with life in ways that we can't really, if we did this in real life, this would just be talk of the town. But, um, still the middle of the night, no one's up, but I'm just chatting away. But, uh, yeah. I think that our time here at the Landrax is done. Zelda's going to be bringing in a new baby, and the, hopefully the kids will be happier because um, they have a better relationship with them, and I guess their aunt's going to be their new stepmom. This reminds me of um, Macbeth. You know, guys, if you know what I'm talking about, um, how Macbeth, his um, dad dies, so, like, his mom gets with his uncle oh gosh it's just too much to handle but i hope you guys liked everything that's happened with the land drags of course the series is not and it's not it's by far not over but i hope you guys have had fun while taking a look at the land drags please comment down below and let me know what family you would like to fudge with next and get to know because we're getting to know sense of valley and feel free to stay and watch the next part of this, which is going to be my upgrade slash renovation of this house. I'm going to add a nursery and such, such, such. So feel free to stay for that. And if not, then bye. But yeah, next up, we will have the renovation. Okay, guys, Um, I was going to film through me actually renovating the house and... For some reason, Fraps really, really lags out and drops frame rates whenever I am in build by mode. It's, like, severe, guys. Like, so if you have any tips for that or if you also have that problem and you fixed it, it might be custom content or something that I have. But, you know, you gotta have the custom content. <laughs> but if you have any suggestions, that's great. But other than that, it's all good. I just went and I decorated the house with what money they had and I actually ran out. I was having so much fun and then all of a sudden I couldn't buy the stuff I wanted and it made me really sad. Um, but I did do a few rooms so I will show you those rooms and show you what I've done. So this is, well obviously the, you're looking at the kitchen. Um, this is what I did. I added stone around here, so it kind of looks like it has a stone backsplash, and I thought this, like, lighting down here is a cool touch. So I added the lighting. I kept the appliances green, but then I made the fridge solid, and I changed the table, made it a little, um, this chair's scooted out, but I made it a little bit more fashionable. I don't know. Yes, um... That's about all I can say. I really did, really, really, really did try to stick with the theme like you guys wanted. And I didn't do anything to this bathroom because, I don't know, bathrooms just aren't that fun to me. Alright, here is the kids' room since Zelda is actually pregnant. Um, this is the baby's room. And, yeah, it's kind of a mess. Like, things barely match, but I think it's cute in that way. Um... Yeah, I just added some clutter and stuff like that, and there's curtains on the window. I just left them, whatever they are, but yeah, since we don't know if it's going to be a boy or girl, I couldn't really make it like a boy or girl nursery, so I just kept it in their obnoxious um, orange and green color theme. And by the way, that is not like what I would pick as a color theme. If I was decorating a house and I was trying to make it really nice, I probably wouldn't pick orange and green, but this is the land. This is classic Landrock, so kept the theme like you guys wanted and then I all I did was add a fruit bowl into the dining room table didn't change anything else in here didn't change anything it's just their living room um, upstairs literally you guys are probably gonna be really disappointed but I didn't change anything about Parker's room or the bathroom didn't change Kaylin's room but I did change the master bedroom and I got a new bed because I thought that was kind of gross if they went up and they slept in the same bed that Dustin sorry and Dustin and Ileana's 
bed. I feel like that's not cool if Zelda and Dustin continue to sleep in the exact same bed that Dustin and Ileana slept in. So I changed that out, and since Zelda is also a green thumb, and it's also implied that she just really enjoys plants in the descriptions, I added some plants into the room, kind of the Zelda touch on the room, and of course... The green and orange is back in this room. I think it looks okay. Um, I just, I don't know what it is about that color combination. But yeah, it looks alright. And that's about all I was able to do before I ran out of money. So I hope you guys aren't like too upset that I didn't really get to do the whole house. If you do want that, then be sure to let me know because I considered cheating and giving them more money. But I didn't know if that would be like okay honestly I never really cheat in the sim so I didn't really want to do it but if you guys if, if you know a lot of you really want that and next time you want me to like renovate the house in full then you know go ahead tell me shout out beneath the video in the comments and I will consider that okay well um this part is probably short I really like I said I really intended to show you guys the whole renovation but that didn't work out. Um, sorry about that. Anyways, uh, thank you so, so much for watching. And um, don't forget to subscribe if you are enjoying this series and you are wanting to see more of that. Also, don't forget to um, follow me on Twitter because that is, I really just like chatting to people on Twitter. And I really, really would like to get to know more of my subscribers. So if you just want to like shout out and chat with me then go ahead and do that yeah all right well anyways i really love to talk but i've got to go now <laughs> thank you guys for watching and i hope you have an amazing day and i will see you in my next video bye guys